Hi everyone! Welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is William. And I'm Cecilia. We are photographer, parents with two kids. Today we want to talk about how we read Bible with our kids who are 10 and 6 years old. If you are new in our channel, we have three different content in this channel. The first one is lifestyle, where we tackle our daily routine with biblical principles. Second is productivity. We want to share with you music that we like to listen so we'll get things done, including work while we are studying and quiet time. The third one is our vlog where we share our fun activities with you. So make sure to check our playlist for our three video content. In this lifestyle video, we want to talk about how we read Bible with our kids who are now 10 and 6. Before we get into it, guys, please smack the like button because your support will truly help our channel so much. To talk about this topic, here are some few points that we will go over and answer. First, let's talk about what is the purpose of the Bible and why is it so important for us? In 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 16 to 17, God has breathed life into all scripture. It is useful for teaching us what is true. It is useful for correcting our mistakes. It is useful for making our lives whole again. It is useful for training us to do what is right. By using scripture, the servant of God can be completely prepared to do every good thing. In Psalm chapter 119, verse 105, it says, your word is a lamp for my feet, a light on my path. So why is it important? Because Bible gives us a strong spiritual guidance to know God more and to live according to His will. Next point is, how often do we read Bible? In Deuteronomy chapter 6 verse 5 to 8, Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul. Love Him with all your strength. The commandments I give you today must be in your heart. Make sure your children learn them. Talk about them when you are at home. Talk about them when you walk along the road. Speak about them when you go to bed. And speak about them when you get up. So how often do we read Bible? We read the Bible every, every day. day. Now these next points are more technical. How do we actually read Bible with the kids? We, we read, read with, with them. them. Your kids learn much more by watching us as their parents do the things. When we read with them, it will motivate them to read as well. We cannot tell them to read the Bible if we don't read it ourselves. We lead by example. And we have to know that the Bible is very important for everyone. So it's not just good for our kids, but it's also good for us. So we cannot stress this enough. Raising kids is actually start from home not church. Our children's spiritual growth is actually our responsibility, the parents, not the pastor, not the Sunday school teacher, but it's us. Next point is, what do we use to read our Bible? We are so blessed to live in this country that we can read Bible. We have so many access to read Bible, not just reading in the actual books. We can also read Bible in our gadget. We use a Bible app called YouVersions and they have so many plans, a very good plans that will guide us to read Bible. Now in our family, we are reading one year Bible where we read Old Testaments and New Testaments together. So what kind of translation that we are using? We are reading Bible using the NIRV. It stands for New International Readers Version. We choose that because NIRV have a simple and easy language. So it's easy for our children to understand it. How we read our Bible by taking turns. So every day from you version, they give us like five to six chapters to read daily. What we do is William's gonna read one chapter and then after William's gonna be my turn with the second chapter and then gonna be Gabriel read the third chapter and also Zion. Even though he's only six years old, but we want him to learn to read. So instead of read the full one chapter, we tell him to read only 10 verses. But he do also have to read every day. The important part is after we read the Bible, we also take time to discuss about anything that important that we maybe Gabriel or Zion don't understand or the important point that we want to emphasize for our kids. Our main priority here is to read to understand, not just read to finish it. You'll be surprised kids at their age, they do have a lot of questions. So we as the parents, kind of challenging for us to 
that we have to answer the questions because parents tend to like oh no 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 just finish it and then get it over with we want to take time sit with them answer the question and discuss now reading bible with the kids can be challenging in many different area for example when we read the old testament there will be a time where we have to read so many names it can be very boring for them even for us as the parents too but the good thing is we are with them. We are doing this together. We are encouraging each other. We are learning about commitment and discipline. The amazing thing is their reading skills is also improved. The important thing about reading Bible with kids is we want to make it fun. We are celebrating when we hit the end milestone. We just finished 100 days like a few weeks ago and we celebrating it together. Gabriel, we're so excited. Oh wow, we already read the Bible for 100 days, something like that. Last but not least, we want to encourage everybody to make notes because we as a human, we tends to forget things very easily. So we make notes if there's anything that we learn, something interesting, we write about it. So that's it. Here are just few easy tips that we are doing as a family and it's very helpful. And I hope that's also will be helpful for you guys as well. If you have any other tips that you want to share, please put in the comment down below. We would love to read and learn from you guys yes. as well. Thanks again for watching guys. Don't forget to check our previous mm -hmm. lifestyle video on how we introduce investment to our kids please consider to subscribe like and share this yes, video yes make the like button that really will support our channel so yes, much yes definitely thank you so much once again and god bless god you god bless you bye bye, bye, -bye.